And, and the thing is, is, you know, one might not have a garden, um, but, you know, the, um, I think you can create a space regardless of your environment that, that is kind of your go-to um, same time, same place. And, 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 it, and it's where you have some ritual of some kind. So just to, to make it more universal, I think that's that's really key. It's you know if you look at you know Charles Duhigg and and um, you know, the power of habit or any book on on habits. You know you've got the trigger. You've got to set this up. You have to be intentional about it, right? And then you've got the routine, and then you've got the reward. That's the habit loop. But um, but but setting setting yourself up with some sort of a trigger so so that it doesn't just sound like a nice idea because that let's 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 be real, right? It's not information that people need. It's it's the it, it's, it's really the system. Like, you know, telling somebody that they should eat healthy and they should exercise is like, well, no shit. Right. But how, how do you actually implement that with everything else that's going on in your life? And that's really, I, I think what, what I have sought out is what's a system that works for me. Cause it's not, it's not universal. What works for you, get to it, get some momentum, stick with it. And that's how, that's like how Jim Rohn described what what is confidence? He said confidence is is not neglecting um, the, the the things that you should do on a daily basis. When you don't neglect that, when you do those little things, you build confidence. And, and that and that to me is 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 really where it's at. Yeah. 